what are the things that they do work on are the weather. They help maintain our weather so that it's not as destructive because there's too many things going on right now on Earth that are causing the weather to be really bad. We have very high seismic, uh, seismographic things like the thing over in Japan, which actually knocked our um, axis off a little bit. Mm -hmm. And also, it's changing the weather. And so they're here to help us get to the next level, is basically what they're doing. They are um, saving humanity because the, every now and then the Earth flips over. Did you know that? Mm -hmm. Every every now and then? Yeah, the there's been, they do. They, the yeah, they flip. They, nobody notices. It just happens. <laughs> <laughs> but um, when it flips over the big flip from one side to the other, um, the whatever is alive perishes on our planet. So they want to keep us alive because we're closer now, humanity-wise, than ever before to becoming part of the galaxy, becoming part of their communication system and alliances, if we want to become part of that. So this is... Um, Earth is under a lot of interest to them right now. A lot of different species are interested in Earth because we're at the next stage of our evolution. Have you noticed that Reiki is becoming more popular? Have you noticed that the Far Eastern uh, mystical religions are becoming more popular? Have you noticed that energy is stronger? This is part of human evolution, is that we live in this uh, magnetic field for so long, we're coming, becoming part of it. You know, our energies are becoming part of a different kind of energy. So we are being elevated, and it's called the Ascension. And I know you've heard about it, and I know some people say, oh, it never started, I was so disappointed. Don't be disappointed, it started. And it started when it was supposed to. The reason why you don't know about it is because it starts really, really small. When you take a beam of light from a flashlight or something and show it out, it comes out like this, right? This is how the ascension is starting with the beam of like a small molecule of light and as it moves it brings more people into it. Do you know understand? It, that's the way it's going to happen. It's not going to zap the world and they're all going to be enlightened. It, we are the beginnings of it and we have to uh, be responsible for that because we have to uh, bring other people with us. What he suggested is that we knit ourselves together individually as a group of enlightened people and bring each other up when they're down. Do you know what I'm saying? Um, as we lift each other up, we get higher vibrations. And so we need to keep that moving. That, that positive movement will gather people. And, and you will see that your intention on learning who your friends are and what their light is made of will bring them into a closer bond with you and then you'll be able to lift them up as well. So uh, that's just one of the things he was teaching us.